Moving on to completing incomplete bar charts, this is quite similar to what I've mentioned previously. However, with this example, we also need to complete the table. The table has some missing information. So we need to put two bars on the graph and put three values in the table. So how many fish did Lucy catch? Let's go to Lucy's bar and it goes all the way up to here, which is between 18 and 20. So it has to be 19 because you can't catch 19.2 fish. So we know it's gonna be a whole number, done. Geraldine goes all the way up to 14. And Lydia goes between 10 and 12, so that has to be 11. Done. Now we just need to fill in the bars for Letitia and Heather. Again, we just need to make sure that the gap between Lucy and Geraldine is exactly the same as the gap between Geraldine and Letitia. And this bar is gonna go up to 15, which is between the 14 and the 16. So again, if you're using a ruler, this is certainly a lot easier. And the width of the bar, oops, went a little bit too high there. The width of the bar is the same as the width of all the other bars as well. There we go, Letitia's done. Again, ruler to make it a straight line will make it much neater. Heather, five. So again, we're gonna make sure that the gaps are consistent in between each bar. And this one here goes up to five, which is just there again, went a slightly too high. And again, all the bars have to be the same width as well. And we're done.